What's up everybody? My name is Coalfire and welcome to Magus Arcana. Now this is a new top-down pixel art dungeon crawler roguelike shooter. Uh, I think it's a shooter at least. Um, but uh, it looked like it revolved entirely around magic and I freaking love magic. Now um, this is a prototype and uh, let's see. You're a wizard on a quest to collect as many artifacts as you can. Delve deep into the dungeons to find the rarest ones. Use the mouse to look around, hold the left mouse button to fire magical projectiles. Once you get low, reload. Okay, so I'm not used to seeing reloads in this uh, kind of game. Tab to open inventory, escape for the pause menu. Perfect, uh, screw it, let's go. I'm assuming, yeah, WSD to move around. Oh, okay. So let's let's see how long the reload is. Okay, it's not very long at all. Okay, it's it might it's a little weird that uh, that's there. Oh, all right. So you guys glow progressively more and more red as you get. Oh, there you go. Press E. What's in here? What are you? Some liquids are best left bottled. Burrow poison. Um, what happens if I click on it? Um, double click? I don't, I don't, I don't know what that does. Can I break these? Are there, are there things in here? Damn it, now that these are, I know that these are breakable, I, I have to break them all to see if there's anything in them. Okay, that is a low fire rate. Maybe that's just because it's the first, like, bit of magic that we have. Oh! Are you supposed to be a minotaur and like a little orc? You guys are, f oh, you're pathfinding AI. I'm so sorry. <laughs> All right, come on, little guys. Time for you to die. May M Jesus, die, you bastard. All right, let's reload and, ooh, grace of the wind. So how do I use these? Oh, I right click, examine. Uh, just the mere presence of this bottle makes you wretch, but there's something alluring about it. Passes, increases damage and mana cost. Uh, examine. Tomes are the quintessential magic supplement. Uh, they can be used by themselves or combined to great or terrible effects. Uh, equip. All right, time between shots is less. Qu okay, um, there we go. All right, faster projectile speed and uh, faster rate of fire. I'm cool with this. Is there gonna be something that happens in here? No. Are these dungeons procedurally generated? Oh, that feels, oh, <laughs> that was quick. Uh, what, grace of the wind? Did we just get two? Can I combine? Combine with you? All right, let's unequip. Combine you. Nope. Okay. Well then. Ah, uh, it was worth a shot. Is there any kind of map or sprint or dash or just other movement abilities, you know? Because I'm just kind of petering along right now. Real nice and slow like. Oh, we just went in the loop. Okay. So where are we going? What are we doing? What are we working towards? We're just trying to clear the whole dungeon? Well, <laughs> I'll be back when I find something to kill. Hey, found something to kill. Okay, so right, can you, you guys can't see my cursor, but it seems like there is some inherent inaccuracy with the uh, ooh, strength of earth. So let's see, we have, I think the time between shots is my most important thing. Okay, so does that do more damage? Mana per bullet 18, uh, damage 14.4 versus 13 point. So this has a higher DPS. So let's uh, combine with you. Tome of Sand, equip, okay, higher Whoa, nice, decent uh, projectile speed and rate of fire and nice damage on it too. Okay, 
that's cool. I like the idea of combining the elements like that. But uh, I just wish that the uh, oh game was a little bit more consistent in its like uptime with the combat. Because I really feel like I'm I'm really having to like track down shit to do in this so far. Uh, e, Tome of Fire. My fire be purged. So obviously I got to try this out. Really, really slow shots, but really high damage. All right, yeah, let's combine that bad boy with the uh, with the wind. Combine Tome of Smoke. So uh, bullet damage. Time between shots, 0.5. Really slow bullet speed, though. Wow, okay, okay. I'm very cool with this. Oh lord, okay. Uh, this is why I want some movement abilities. Like a, a little dash, or... Is that it? Okay. What is this? Strength of Earth? So, can I combine, like, a Tome of Sand with... No. Can I... No. Okay, so it looks like it's just... Two combinate. Oh! Hey there, bud! Uh, if I go into my menu... Ah, uh, does that pause the game? Nope, nope, equip, equip. Okay, that, return to game. All right, there we go, that's what I wanted to do. Oh, Jesus, is this guy actually hurting me? All right, I can't get away from you fast enough, so. <laughs> oh God, come on, oh, that's that's all the shots I got. Ah, 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 Yes, I wanted to combine fire and earth. Uh, so, Tome of Earth. Com I just, I just fucking discarded it. God damn it. The Cold Delve. Yeah, so, I, I, I kind of wish that there was like a little, a, a dash or a sprint or, ow, or something along those lines because as it stands, the only other movement thing there is, is the penalty while I reload. And uh, I get this is a prototype, but it feels a little strange to me that like, the only extra movement thing there is, is uh, the opposite of movement. <laughs> All right. Especially with how often you have to reload. Please be Tome of Earth. Yes. Okay. Combine with you. Okay, so what is this? Um... What? Hold up, hold up, hold up. So, Tome of Lava consumes half of my mana for an 18 damage shot, while the Tome of Smoke consumes a quarter of my mana for a, a, a 20 damage shot. So, fuck the Tome of Lava. <laughs> I'm never making that shit again. Oh, oh no, 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 ah. Yeah, I don't know how I feel about the reload at all. It, it kind of kills the pace, which already isn't really there. What is this, water? Uh, let's equip you, nine damage, 0.5. Uh, 18 mana? Like... I think the game could do entirely without the reload mechanic, and it could just go off of the balance of, like, the rate of fire. It just, it's so strange to me that there's something that, that kills the movement so... incredibly potently. Yeah, we didn't grab this one. Uh, cool, we got two tomes of water. Can I combine like tomes? No. Okay. Um, I'm sticking with the Tome of Smoke simply because of how much damage it does. Yeah, if I could, like, dash around or roll or make a burrito while I'm reloading, it's definitely enough time to. Yeah, look, look, fucking Tome of Smoke, man. That is the... Fucking just discard, discard. All right, what's going on in here? 
Yeah, get fucked, sir. There's no problem reloading when there's nothing to shoot you while you're reloading. And by shoot, I mean walk menacingly into you. All right, reload. Pardon me, sir. I'm just gonna, you know, be, be right past you real quick. Reload. Uh, Tome of Strength of Earth. So what do we think this is gonna be? Water and earth together? I'm not, I'm not sure. Tome of Mud, okay. Uh, equip, let's see. 12 damage, 0. 0.7, 24 versus 20.5, 24. Really? Like the bullets are a little bit faster, but like, I don't know, with the enemies that are in here, the, the biggest deal to me seems like damage and the number of times you can fire. So I'm I'm sticking with the, the Thomas Smoke because it does the it does the good dams. Alright, have we been in this one already? I think we might have. Reload boss time? Or is this where we came in? Uh is there M, M does nothing for map. I doesn't do inventory, which I'm I'm kind of fine with. Um I prefer our inventory on tab, actually. Like, yeah, this, this is a lot of rewards for Tome of Fire. Yeah, so if I get another Tome of Water, I think we'll get, like, the Tome of Steam or something. Hey, bye. <laughs> Are certain attacks stronger against certain types of enemies? Because these guys just... Oh, they're pitiful. They are. In terms of their health, I mean. I like their design. Um, Tome of Mud. Tome. Wait, did we just pick up a Tome of Mud? Or did it automatically combine with my Tome of Water? Um, okay, first off, discard. 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 Yeah. Okay. Tome of Smoke is where it's at, man. I am starting to wish there was a map here. Because... Because there's not really a lot of variation between the different uh, areas. Really hard to tell where I've been and where I haven't. Alright. Oh, hey there, bud. I didn't see you hiding in there. You're not dead? Okay. You're a resilient bastard. Tome of water. Combine with... Tome of steam! Told ya! Alright, so let's see this difference. 13 damage at 0.5. Really high bullet speed. Whereas, again... Like... That's cool and all, but... Given how often we have to reload, doing the high damage shots is still the best because it, it leaves you open the least. Because if you're doing a hell of a lot of damage when you're uh, in between reloads, then it's that's the, that's the way to go. I'll try it out, but I feel like I'm just going to be reloading more often, which I think is the weakest part of the game. Or at least some sort of, like, mana upgrades. That'd be cool. Where am I? Where is the world? I, I, I feel like I can't even break a fucking crate open. There, look at that. What, what was... What did I just pick up? Oh, it was an extra inventory slot. Cool. Oh, man. There we go, get away, reload. Do you actually do damage to me? I don't know if I've seen you do damage to me. 
Are you just are you just having a hard time hitting me? Is that what's Oh there it is. Nice, okay. Well, I gotta wait. Come on man, there we go. Reload, reload, reload. Okay, cool. Boop, 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 boop. This is what I mean about the like the damage between reloads being so important. Because no matter what, with the combined tomes, I'm getting about four shots per reload. And whether or not my shots do 20 damage or 13 damage is going to be the biggest deciding factor on how much damage I'm doing. If I have an extremely high rate of fire, but can still only fire four shots per magazine, I'm still going to be reloading as often as I would be with uh, like the Tome of Smoke. So I, I can see the different abilities being balanced by their rate of fire, by their projectile movement speed, and by the distance the projectiles can go. But as long as that mana bar is there, it's not going to be enough of a difference to, uh, to make anybody not pick the strongest one. Because if you can do 80 damage versus, what would that be, like 52 damage? per magazine with that long of a reload between each uh, round of shots. It's a huge difference. It's a huge difference. So let's let's keep going. The Grim Lair, okay. And I, I also feel kind of discouraged from trying to loot things, which I have a feeling that there's, yeah, health and inventory upgrades laying around because it's one, two, three, four, reload. And because there's already such a long pause in between the different combat sessions, um, it's, it's just kind of tedious non-gameplay. I get that I'm being kind of hard on the game, but it's obviously got some systems here that that are worth building upon. It's just that some of them are... What are you? Tome of Dark. Let's see. Equip. 36 damage at 60... Okay, so... What do what it equip? So that's high damage, low rate of fire. I'm combining these motherfuckers. Actually, I I want to I want to see what the Tome of Dark is by itself. One shot between reloads. Okay, so combine. Really? It can combine with the Tome of Steam into the Tome of Smoke. Well, I just fucking wasted that. Damn, that sucks. Okay, well, we're learning. Um, it'd be cool, too, if there was... After you experiment with the different ones, if it would come up with a, uh, a recipe list. What am I using right now? Is this fucking... Is this the Tome of Steam? Oh, no, that was just the, the standard arcane. I'd like to find some health. Reloading. All right. Boop. What? A wearable amulet. Uh, examine. Some amulets enhance a mage's potential. This one is no exception. Use it at your own... Chaotic... Equip chaotic beam damage with spells. Equip. Whoa. Okay. Well... Okay, so does that... Oh, that does hurt you. Okay, cool. Uh, cleansing waters, cool. So, using the beam... Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, full reload. Full reload. Shot. Full reload. Full reload. Shot. No. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. 
I think the only kind of item that I would be willing to fuck with is anything that uh, decreases how often I have to reload. <laughs> Well, it's it's great that I have such a huge inventory for all of these things that I'm not getting. <laughs> yep, yep, more inventory space. That looks like a boss room. Just uh, meandering about. Doop, 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 doop. What are you? Okay, so let me see. Passive increases damage and mana cost. So. That's cool, I guess. Three. Now I can only fire three times. Hmm. I don't. Oh, Jesus. Hey there, guys. Ow. You know what, Smokey? I don't. I don't. I don't need you here. Stop. Ah, oh, crap. Okay. Go. Can I have some health? What are you? Uh, Tome of the Wind, Tome of the Water? What, what will that be? Tome of Ice, okay. So, 12 damage, 28. Versus 23 damage and 28. Again, the, like, it doesn't matter how much uh, what the rate of fire, what the range is when this when this reload is in place, because it's just like that's the rate limiting step in your in your fire rate, no matter what. I'm gonna keep harping on about it because it's frustrating. This game could be really awesome. I think it's got a lot of cool stuff going on in it. Like I really like the idea of combining these magic tomes that you find. The artwork's pretty good. The level design, average. Art design, average. Uh, the sound design could definitely use some work, and I would love to see some new movement abilities in here, but I don't know. As it stands, there's, there's no reason to use anything but the strongest attacks. When they all cost the same amount of mana, they all force reloading the same way. Like, if there was a tome that did one damage per shot, but used um, no mana, I, I would probably use that instead, just so I would never have to reload. Okay, uh, like one of these dropped health a while back, so I feel like I'm being forced into uh, breaking all of these chests. Somebody give me health, please! <laughs> Tome of wind. Maybe yeah, yeah, yeah. fucking discard, discard, discard. Uh, can I can I move? Yeah, there we go. Discard, discard. Now I have five shots. Look at that. Oh my god, sweet, glorious firepower. I just like being able to shoot. Is that so wrong? All right, was there was there something going on in here? The lights turned on, but no enemies showed up. Can I can I can I please get some health? Somebody? Anybody? We'll suck dick for hats. No. 
please. Oh, can I trade inventory spaces for hats? I want to trade my handbags for for delicious health. Please. Please. Please, hat God, I broke a whole room and no hats. Alright, so where to now? Is there any way to, like, ah, there we go, some darkness, delicious. Oh, look at all that sweet, sweet shooting! Look at that, we got five rounds! I'm so happy! <laughs> okay, cool, you did the die, congratulations. Tome of the Wind. Okay, cool. Do you guys, do you guys have any hats? I feel like at this point I'm I'm being forced against my will to uh, to open up every single one of these just because I need a uh, just a hat a hat would be amazing please show oh, okay well you know what you know what if we die I will be free of this reloading coil but I will not go peacefully into that darkness into the dark. Is that is that the line? I don't remember. Okay. Load. Oh, so you are a ground-based enemy. Hats! Tome of Earth. Okay, so did we have we combined Tome of Wind and Tome of Yes we have. Hey there, big guy. What the fuck am I using right now? Okay, cool. Yes, please. Let me out, let me out, let me out. Um, the game's got potential. As a prototype, I think it's all right. I think it is. But, uh... I've said everything that I've wanted to say about the reloading. The fact that it stops your movement, that you have to do it so goddamn often, um, it just, it feels bad. Uh, I think all of the different weapon types could be balanced purely by their fire rate, projectile speed, range, and damage alone, because uh, that reload is the great equalizer among the the fire rate and the mana cost and all of that uh as it stands because of the delay that you have in every single magazine the rate of fire does not fucking matter and in fact uh, a higher rate of fire with similar mana costs and lower damage is objectively a worse weapon because you will be reloading more often. So, uh, it just, it doesn't work. As for the non-combat time, time, types, time, um, there's, there's gotta be a better way to both move around, explore, pick up items, and track where you are. So, I'm making a fucking to-do list for this game because I want it to be better. I think it has a lot of potential and I love games where you get to play as wizards. Um, so, a, a crafting list. So as soon as you have mixed two tome types, it tells you what it is. Um, a <laughs> are you sure button for dropping items because it's right next to the combine button. Um, like triple the movement speed, triple the enemy's movement speed, um, give the player some sort of dodge dash with invulnerability frames. The reason, so this game compared itself to the Binding of Isaac and I can definitely see that in the like kind of slow rate of fire, kind of slow movement. But the thing with those games is that they're room based and the rooms always fit on screen. And there's a mini map. 
So when you're exploring in a game like that, you know where you are, you know where you're going, and you know where you haven't been yet. In this game, you know where you haven't been yet, but you don't know where you're going, and you don't know where you've been. The only thing that indicates any of those things are the torches on the wall. And that's a fine way of doing it, but when we're so zoomed in on a map this large, uh, and all of the areas look virtually identical in terms of their color design and layout, it's impossible to tell where the fuck you are. And wandering around aimlessly while having to reload after every two objects you break just isn't that fun, which is another reason I hate the reload. Um, so I, I would make it maybe that just like walking into those objects breaks them, or maybe it does. Or if you end up adding some sort of dodge dash, that kind of thing will also break the items. Because right now, opening chests um, is probably the most tedious part of the game in a game where it's already pretty tedious to get around. Um, focusing on upping the pace of combat, maybe the, the brutality of it as well, giving the player less health, maybe the enemies more damage, but giving the player more ways to mitigate that damage so it becomes a more active fight. Uh, just because a game with certain mechanics was popular does not necessarily mean those mechanics are perfect. And uh, with how big these areas already are, it, it makes me think that it could get away with dumping a whole lot of enemies at you and making it a lot more fast and frantic about your positioning, your movement. Um, and I don't think you can fall into pits right now, but that might not be a bad thing to do with like the dodge dash. If you dodge dash into a pit, then you lose a hat. So I think the game has great potential and as a prototype, it's okay but it has a lot of problems and that's the only reason I'm being so hard on it is because I see the groundwork for a fucking fantastic game here and I just think there, there are some design decisions that have been made that are counterproductive to what this game could be and uh, what I see in it. But yeah, if you guys want to try this out for yourselves, this has been Magus, Ma Magus Arcana, Arcana. Fucking words, man. Um, so many different pronunciations. But if you guys want to try it out for yourselves, the link is down in the description below. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Coalfire, and I see you next time.